Hey, what's up? What's up? What's up? Hey, it's your boy Skills. How y'all doing today? Hey, so told y'all I was gonna do um, like a detailed unboxing of Modern Warfare 3, um, the hardened edition. So that's what y'all tuned in for. But I just want to give y'all a little bit of history. All right, this is the third one. So this is the first uh, Modern Warfare. And I'm pretty sure many of y'all have seen this, played this, probably bought multiple copies of this. So that's the first one. Second one, and I actually got the Prestige Edition for this. It had all the special little things with it in the steel, the steel book, um, hardened edition. So and then that's the second one. And then, of course, the third one. right here. So what I'm going to do is, in the short, short short amount of time I have before I have to roll to work, I'm going to go ahead and do the detail unboxing. I did upload the unboxing, but this one is going to go into, I mean, just insane amount of detail. Alright, so go ahead, grab your popcorn, grab your snacks, grab your drinks. Ew. Just sit back and enjoy the ride. Alright, so this Today is October, I'm sorry, November 8th, 2011, the day the game was released. And there are actually two two versions of the game. Um, this year they did not do a prestige edition, but the regular one and then the hardened. So, and then this is the hardened case for it. Explains to you that there is a steel book case that comes with it. The future downloadable content, the elite and also the uh, journal, limited edition field journal, and then avatar. And then this is the case. Right, and this is the, I have the 360 version. And then that's the contents of it. Right. And then this is the Call of Duty Elite founder card and on the back of it has the founder number um, I don't know if these are you know how many they are all together and then it's a really tight fit okay and then the diary and if you look at it it actually looks somewhat um, distressed and it says at the end um, at the back of it Crendon Hill Press I don't know if that's a real place, if that exists or not. I haven't had time to do it, so we can go ahead and go through it. So when it opens up, there's a blank page. So I'll probably just... Captain Price, and if you are familiar with the Call of Duty 2, Captain Price makes an appearance in there. He's, um, like, I remember him, the, the demo that they had, he's like the last um, talking soldier that I remember. And then this is all, like I said, it's just, it has a very distressed look to it and feel. And then we ran across, like, the first note which is actually supposed to be like a newspaper clipping and it's in Russian so not quite sure what it says so really really sweet like I said the thing is um Activision sent me this for free to review. And then if you remember at the end of uh, Modern Warfare, the original, that they had this picture. And the Glasgow football task force 141 drawing and 
in the airplane, you remember, um, the, the airliner at the end, the Mile High Club for the original Modern Warfare. That was the schematic for that. SAM site. Surface to air missile. And then this right here is the the um, the gulag that they had um, Captain Captain Price in from a Modern Warfare 2. Like I said just insane amount of detail. And this right here, really, really cool. I love reading stuff like this. You know, a lot of times some people are just like, uh, oh, I got it, and they want the freebies. This appears to be like blood of some type. So, does it feel? Feels different, you know. So it's like some kind of, yeah, it definitely feels different than the rest of the regular pages. And this one is the uh, terminal, like for an airplane. Just different um, tactics, plans. Page ripped out. I didn't do it. Then I guess they have um, extra pages. Even it appears to be like mildew on the pages, which is kind of sweet. And I guess that's pretty much it. And they even got that. Can you see that? Made in China. Ha ha ha. That's funny. Okay. And And as um, so at the end of the book, okay, that was that earlier thing. Anyway, at the end of the book, there's like a little pocket, and in it, it has some other stuff, including like a fake little um, match. <laughs> now, what's funny is, all right, can you see that? Those aren't real matches. So the back of it is actually a real. I mean, you it's a striker that you can use, but this right here, yeah, these are fake. Really interesting, you know, why they make fake ones. But I mean, I guess they just don't want stuff blowing up. So, all right. So, that's the little um, little diary or journal. Everything really, really cool. And oops. Okay. And of course, this is the case. And then the steel steel book. It's a very similar to the Black Ops steel book. And then this was actually under um, under like where where it says where Call of Duty is. This was actually under this. So this is the founder um, instructions. So pretty interesting stuff in there. Digital content. 
and it says thank you. On the back of it has um, instructions on how to redeem codes. So, and then the actual game itself. And it's silver, so I believe it's a single layer. Let's see. So. Then the manual. <coughs> and then the steel book um, insert. So it appears to be New York under attack. Right. So I'll go ahead and put that back right there. And then the manual. Um, standard fare. Someone just emailed me, don't worry. It's okay. It's all good in the hood, trust me. All right. Last page. And then information on um, Call of Duty Elite. So, okay. So, all right. So, that's, that's everything with that. Uh, like I said, the game dropped today. Um, and I was fortunate that. Activision sent me a copy. So, all right. So, that's it. Stay tuned to your boy skills. Um, you know, like as far as unboxings and everything. Now, um, I did have some other stuff, but I told, you know, like, <clears throat> uh, what I told, what I said earlier was that I was going to do a very detailed unboxing of Modern Warfare 3, the hardened edition. And then that's what you got. So, thank y'all so much for tuning in. Like I said, it's your boy skills. And um, I'm, I'm on Google. Facebook, Google Plus, Facebook, um, Twitter, just all social media. I have a, like I said, a Facebook fan page that you know you can follow. Follow, you know, just me a little bit more personable, you know, than on YouTube and everything. But thank y'all very much for tuning in. Have an awesome, awesome day, and you know, enjoy Modern Warfare Three. So. You will, I know I will. Thank you very much, Activision, for sending me um, a review copy for free. Thank you. Have a good day. Deuces.